Young. Okay. I just filmed the whole video without the audio on and I think I'm gonna kill someone. Hi guys, welcome or welcome back to my channel. Long time no film. I have not filmed a video in almost five weeks because I've had exams, I've had 18 exams, they are all done and dusted and now I am on summer holiday. I'm so excited to film for you guys and put all my effort, time and hard work into filming and I just cannot wait for the upcoming videos to go. I wanted to start going back into YouTube by filming kind of a laid back video which you guys actually wanted which is an updated what is on my iPhone 7 plus starting off with a little overview of my phone i've got the iphone 7 plus in matte black which is yeah, the title of the video i've got the 254 56 gigabytes the highest gigabyte capacity i purchased this with my own money and i knew that i wanted the highest storage because i just knew that i wanted the biggest the best i am broke right now with everything that i purchased yeah okay going into it when you open my phone the background that i have is just prague it's a picture that i got off pinterest so i edited a little bit i whitened it put an effect on it. My friend Michelle and I have always wanted to go to Prague or travel somewhere together. So me, Michelle and my mom may go to Prague, hopefully if my mom gets her visa. So I don't know, I just really like this picture of Prague and I just kind of wanted it as the background. Hopefully we get to travel in a few days and yeah, I'll definitely film it for you guys. And when you go into my phone, it's the exact same background and the first page that I have is like basically the main apps that you can get. I usually just like the first page to be like the main apps and all my personal apps can be on the second page because it is like my personal apps or something. It's starting with an overview of the first few apps it's outlook because i don't like the usual mail that they give you i don't like it and i've got calendar and then i've got photos i have got a lot of photos yeah i've got 8,000 photos you guys can see and i just i'm going to take advantage of how much capacity i have going through a little bit of my photos um it was kyra's birthday today and i just got some photos of her so kyra if you're watching this happy birthday got loads of photos i need to delete some of them but i was not bothered and i've got camera i'm not even going to show you my room you can see a little sneak peek of the camera but i'm not going to show you my room because it's so messy i have got maps clock weather notes weird thing that i put on notes is like my captions for instagram obviously i make notes on like randomly in the middle of the night if i think of a video idea or i think of something i have to do i make so many captions like these are all my captions for instagram i don't know i don't really i don't know if i should show you guys because they're like my personal captions you know more maybe one day i'll show you but like honestly i just go on pinterest or just make one up but they're usually like quite cringe but anyway then i've got reminders which is where i just like put little reminders that i have to do I've got itunes store app store tv settings contacts messages and calculator and at the bottom row i've got phone safari and and music which is just like what I usually use I just like it at the bottom and going on to the next page which is more of like my personal apps I have Shazam it's literally this app was given by the gods it is such a good app honestly if you don't know a song you just Shazam it and then it gives you the song and you can download it and all is good I've got Twitter I've got Twitter which I never really use but now I'm like starting to use it a lot more I feel like you can get more of the gossip and more of the background information of like drama on YouTube or drama overall I don't really post a lot on Twitter but say if I come out of an exam and I just knew like I just nah I would post a little gif I mean you guys can see here yeah that's usually what I do if you guys want to follow me or tweet me my social media links will be all over here so I've got Pinterest I don't really post on Pinterest it's just when I'm like trying to feel creative or get some ideas I've got Facebook then I've got Snapchat which Snapchat I do use quite a lot so if you guys want to add me um, social media links will be around here so this is like on the daily what I post. Gotta send my streaks and all that. Then I've got Messenger for Facebook. Instagram, I literally use all the time. I love Instagram. You can see I've posted 258 photos. It's insane. I just post all the time. I've got YouTube, obviously, because, you know, gotta watch them videos. I've got Studio. I'm sure you guys all know what that is. I've got Tumblr. I never use it. I don't know why I have it. I just haven't deleted it. WhatsApp and Uber. Going on to the next page. This is all like my photo editing apps. If you guys want like a how I edit my Instagram, Instagram video thingy definitely like this video and comment down below I feel like I want to put it in another video because I'm very specific I just cracked my finger I'm very specific in how I edit my videos and I feel like it's quite a process and I don't know shut up I want to make a video on like how I take my pictures or tips for Instagram or blah 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 so I'm definitely going to film another video like that the apps that I do use for editing my photos is Afterlight, Facetune, Whitegram which gives you like a white border, Disco or VSCO cam whatever you call it, Layout, 
preview grid, and then symbol. Basically, just like these little symbols that you can get. You can put as like a caption on Instagram. I mean, this is usually what I'll use if I don't know what to caption something. Then got Canva, which is how I edit my thumbnails. I usually edit my thumbnails on my laptop, but say if I don't have my laptop with me, I can edit it on here. I've got health and then Swerk It, which is just a workout app. Usually I'll go to the gym and like do a seven minute workout and then daily yoga. I should really do yoga because I've got a lot of problems with my neck and my back and like I just need to like stretch and release all this tension, you know? Okay, so then moving on to the next page is where I have all of my shopping apps, I guess. I have Amazon, Victoria's Secret, Souk.com, ASOS, Snapchat, Sheen, Drive. Drive is like Google Drive, for, which I use for my school. Zaffle, which is, you know, a bikini thing. I actually just ordered some bikinis, which I just tried on. It just got delivered, so look out for a video bikinis and all that. Gmail which is for school as well. I've got Uber Eats. Episode, I feel like kind of embarrassed about like what I'm about to tell you but episodes basically like you get to be this character and then you get to have this episode with like some famous person so say I had an episode with like the Dolan or Dolan whatever you call it. Dolan twins. Dolan twins? I think it's Dolan twins. Basically Grayson and Ethan. Not Ethan. Grayson and Ethan both liked me and I was like who do I choose? And I was like, can I just have both of you? But yeah, it's a lot of drama and it's really cool. I've then got another app called Recolor, which is basically you just color things in. Should use more often to like decrease my bipolar issues and like decrease my stress levels. But basically you just color things in. I mean, things that I've done, not really a style of work, but I mean. Going on to the next page, these are literally all my extra items that I don't really use. First folder, which is just extras, is everything that you get with the phone. So it's garage band, watch iTunes U, iMovie. I then have an app called Notebook which I keep like far away mainly because I don't know if I should tell you guys when I get in an argument I will write down everything that has been said and that has been done. Um, I do this because I'm a weirdo and I'm a bit crazy. Also like I want to read them in the future, maybe make a story time out of them, I don't know. Not really interesting but that's what I like doing so. Any of my friends are watching this video and they're like oh I want to see what arguments Megan has had and like go on my phone and then go on this app, I will kill you. I will literally kill you. I've then got iBooks, Podcast, Home, Compass, Mail, Numbers, Voice Memos, iCloud and then Go Out which is like, I don't even know, I feel like this is a tourist app which I'll probably use in Prague and then I've got Google Maps. Next folder, I've labeled it weirdo because I'm a weirdo. Talabat, Talabat is how you say it. It names all the restaurants and all the food that they've got. Mato, tomatoes, and mottos, same sort of thing. Followers, and I can like see who's unfollowed me. I'm such a loner. I've got bit emoji, gotta have those bit emojis in your Snapchat. I've got Skype, and then I've got sub count where I can see how many subscribers I have. Okay, going on to the next folder, these are all the games that I kind of have. I've got Vox Cinemas and Real Cinemas. I go to the cinema a lot. Unis is basically like an app who gives you like all of the updated gossip on the celebrities so gotta keep up. Best Fiends, I'm not even going to show you this app because I'm sure you guys have watched every video with like some YouTuber who's sponsored by the app. I'm not, not that famous. Heads up, Musical.ly, don't really go on Musical.ly. I mean sometimes I will to watch Jacob Sartorius or whatever his name is. With the app SN which is like you kind of like a snake I guess and you like connect the dots but then you can't touch the snake. Does that make sense? You can touch the snake. That sounds so odd. And then AA, same sort of thing. Not really. You've got to put the dots in the circle. I'm not even going to try. Uh, then I've got a colour app, same sort of thing. Is that a fidget spinner? That's a fidget spinner. Oh my god. Okay, then the next app. I could have put all these apps in like the other folder of the extras, but I'm that person who needs the four apps or four folders at the top because it was a bit crazy. Going into this folder, I have Keynote, Pages, Docs, Excel, Classroom, which is for school, and then Photo Math, which is like when I did maths and know an equation or didn't know the answer to an equation, you just take a picture, it gives you the steps, gives you the answers. Great app. Find friends, don't have any. Find the iPhone, tips, FaceTime, wallet, broke, and stop. And that is literally it on my iPhone. Like I went through this video like super, super fast, but I just literally wanted to give you guys a brief overview of what is on my iPhone. Didn't want to make it too detailed ready for more upcoming videos on my channel i'm so excited to film i cannot tell you guys how much i've missed you i love you all to the moon and back and i will see you in my next video bye guys